Uh, his usual standards of, of pitchability, the, the, the strikes that he threw, really felt like that the middle innings through the end is when he had his best stuff. The, the first couple of innings, there were some, some balls that got left up that uh, we made some great plays on, uh, but he settled in and, and, and really got the breaking ball in play nice and sharp. Uh, fastball down away, the fastball up. Uh, just felt like that he had a little bit of everything in play for himself tonight, and what a what a fun game to watch all the way around. Just between Colby, uh, the defense, and some of the timely hitting, but fun defensive plays out there for for Colby. You can you can tell that how these guys want to play for each other and, and what they're willing to do and what they're willing to lay out on the line for each other is exceptional night all, all the way around and uh, great job by our coaching staff putting some 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 defenders in, in some really good spots um, tonight. Uh, Jeff, what's the mood like in the dugout when a guy is six outs away from a perfect game? I mean, is it electric? Can you feel something going on there? Absolutely. Uh, it, it, these guys know exactly what's going on. They They – they know it's, uh, and you can tell, you can see, you can feel, you can, you can see the energy of how guys are going after the baseball out on the field. But inside the uh, the dugout, they're pulling for every single pitch, uh, every strike, uh, every swing and miss, every ball that gets put in play. Uh, you see everybody in the dugout, a little little, they, they sit up out of their seats or they stand up and they're, and they're looking for a play to be made. Yes, it's it's electric inside the dugout when you have things like that going on. Talked, you mentioned it a couple times already, the play that Odor made, the play that Delano made, the catch that Chu made. You don't get – pitchers don't get that deep without some plays like that being made. Right? Yeah, there's there's always some plays along the way that you, you look up at the end of the night in a game like that, especially when special things happen, and, and, you, and you can point to them. But uh, great energy tonight to be back home. Uh, the fans are into it. You could – you could hear them on every single pitch and borderline pitches that didn't get called, and some of them weren't borderline. They were out of, out of strike zone that our, our fans were, were wanting really hard. But uh, just a, a great night all around, and, and, and really just can't say enough about the job that, that Colby has done and uh, did tonight. And coming back after the, his last start, uh, you know, that's we, we come to, to look forward to those type of things because we know what, what, what the guy's capable of. He just kind of alluded to it, his last start. He'd had three rough starts that had piled up. Is he the kind of guy that you anticipate at some point? He's maybe not expecting a perfect game into the eighth, but he's going to bounce back at some point. Yeah, I keep, I keep hearing that three rough starts. Uh, I'm not so, so, so sure that they were rough. There was a couple pitches here and there in, in those last couple starts and that, that really got away from him that uh, still felt like he had good stuff, and it's, it's felt like he's had his good stuff. But just it's, it comes down to – the Colby and location execution, and and he was on top of all that tonight. I hope this isn't treading on that question, but Colby's got 15 wins with Barrett Hall. Yet there've been a couple starts this year, 10 runs, the one the other night. Is he at his best when somebody knocks him down for one time or takes one shot? What I know about Colby and the history of uh, Colby Lewis, and and you paint the picture and you track uh, this guy all the way back to high school that. The things that he's gone through and the resilience that he has, I, I gotta believe that uh, pretty tough cat. That when he gets pushed around, knocked down, he's he's not out of the fight at all. He's he jumps right back into it. I, I don't think you're gonna push him around much. 